Uh, in this video, I want to talk about the LinkedIn outreach strategy that I've been using um, with another uh, with Commerce Hero. Um, that's been working pretty well um, in order to reach out to people in my space and, and tell them about the product. Now, a lot of the outreach that you see on LinkedIn is very kind of cheesy and slimy and spammy. Um, and uh, so, what I what I've done, it's it's very simple. It's not rocket science, but there's a couple little finesse pieces to it. So what I generally do um, is that I reach out to people in my second degree network um, and I, um, I connect with them. Now I'll, you know, I'll kind of quick screen them like I'm, if I'm mainly, mainly looking for developers versus, so uh, step back. Before, uh, the, the key is to search on, the keyword you're gonna search on, um, you ideally wanna find a skill within LinkedIn um, so Magento, for example, is a skill. So you can search for people. There's about 180,000 people. Uh, you could search on PHP as another skill with like a couple million. So finding a skill to search on that gives you a, a large pool of people. Um, so you'll search on that and then within your second degree network and then reach out and connect with them. Obviously, you want to make sure that your profile looks looks interesting um, if your if your job title is you know recruiter um, or sales or something people are going to see that be less interested you know it might um, you know just your avatar everything like my um, title was is founder right so people are more tr trustful of that for better or worse <laughs> um, no and then so you go in you do uh, connect um, and then you want to you don't want to do too many per day um, you'll you'll get flagged but LinkedIn will um, you'll need to pay for a, a LinkedIn um, uh, subscription because you'll get blocked after a few searches if you're on the free plan so you got to pay for it and then um, so the key is you want to do a nice volume so I would do maybe 100 per day you don't want to do more than that because you get blocked but you know so you do that 100 per day day after day after day after day that really starts to add up so I think I'm up to like 12 13,000 contacts and I haven't even been doing this for the past month or so, I don't know, there was a few months in there, I was very consistent, and then you know things have gotten busy and I haven't been doing it. So doing that every single day really, really starts to add up. So do the connect request, um, and then I generally don't put a message in there. I know some people do recommend that. Um, if the, you know, if, if there's probably some people that, in my, myself personally, the way I handle incoming requests, I look at the person's profile. If they look interesting, I'll accept. If they don't, I won't. I, the message doesn't matter quite as much to me. So I'll do a connect request, and then um, if they if they accept it, the message I send them is super short and sweet. So I'm not a fan of these big wall of text type messages. So I'll say, um, hey, great to connect. Um, I just launched this thing for the Magento community. Let me know if you don't mind me shooting you a link to check it out. So I specifically don't include the link in the first message. I did experiment with that a little bit. It feels a little spammy, like you just met someone. Here's a link. Go click, go click on my link. So I just asked their permission before sharing it. A lot of times people are like, yeah, of course, just send it, send it, man. Um, but that little tweak, I, I, I think I like. Obviously, if this video goes viral and everyone in the universe starts using this technique, it probably won't work very well um, because people will you know, recognize it and things like that. Some people ask me like, hey, is this a bot? Um, and I'm like, no, I'm literally doing it myself manually for each one. You know, you can copy and paste the message. I actually built a little Chrome extension that quickly inserts the message, but I do it all myself manually. It's not a bot that's running. Um, and then so, so yeah, that's pretty much the technique. And then once they say, yeah, it's cool, I send them the link and that's it. And uh, it's really not rocket science, um, but if you do that day after day after day, you can really, um, you can really get, uh, do some nice outreach. So that's the, that's the strategy there. If you have any questions, let me know. We'd love to hear from you.